Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I am so excited for today's video because as you can tell by the title, I bought some more Bath & Body Works stuff. I literally just can't wait. So they had some Christmas stuff out and some of the Christmas scents were on sale for $11.95, I wanna say. So they were more than half off, which is such a good deal for Bath & Body Works candles. So I figured I had to pick up a few things. I didn't go super crazy with buying things, so that's why this is gonna be a two-part video. The first part is going to be just a little haul of the Bath & Body Works Christmas stuff I got. And the second part is actually going to be me decluttering my towel linen closet because it's a complete disaster. So I know it's two very different video ideas merged into one, but I figured both videos were too short to do on their own, so why not merge them together? So if you want to skip forward, if you don't care about Bath & Body Works and you just want to see the decluttering, go ahead and skip forward. I will put a timestamp in the video so you know where to go for the video. But for now, I want to get into the Christmas stuff from Bath & Body Works. Like I said, I didn't go crazy. I usually just grab everything that smells good and I end up with way too much and it overflows into the following year. So I tried to avoid doing that this year and I got very few things. So I'm going to start really quickly. Just I bought one little mini hand lotion and I bought this in the Twisted Peppermint scent. I cannot express how much I love this scent. It is so fresh and clean so Christmassy. My absolute favorite scent this year by far. So I had to grab just a little hand soap to keep at my desk at work. Moving on to the wallflowers. You guys know I have a wallflower in the bathroom, in the kitchen, in the living room. Like I have them all over and once we get our house in January I'm going to be getting more so that there's one in basically every room just so every room always smells good and inviting. But for now, I picked up two Christmas scents for our wallflowers. The first one I got is Cinnamon Stick, which is just like your classic warm, spicy cinnamon scent, which I love. It says the notes in this are Cinnamon Stick, Vanilla, and Spiced Sugar. So very basic, but like such a classic. And then of course, I got it in the Twisted Peppermint scent. I can't get enough of this scent. I might have to go back and grab another one because... I have a total of four wallflowers in my apartment and I only bought two. So I might have to go buy a couple more when they have some more flavors coming out. But the Twisted Peppermint scent is Cool Peppermint Sugared Snow and Vanilla Buttercream. So lastly, we'll move on to the candles. My favorite, probably your favorite as well, I love candles. I'm actually still burning my Halloween candle right now even though it is November 1st because I just didn't burn all the way through it but I'm gonna finish it off today anyways back to Christmas candles the first one I got is the cinnamon stick to go with the wallflower I like to kind of pair them up not any particular reason why I do that I just do so I got the cinnamon stick candle it's like such a gorgeous just like classic Christmas red color oh, it just smells so good I absolutely love this and then of course I got the twisted peppermint Ugh. I love it. I wish they had different packaging for this because this feels a little bit like Candyland to me, just like kind of childish, but who cares when it smells this good? Oh my god, I could smell this all day long. I remember I got this last year. Actually, I still have it. So last year they had the same thing, but it was called Let It Snow, or maybe that was just I don't know they just had different packaging and I never burnt all the way through it but it doesn't smell as good now because it has been burnt and it's a year old but I absolutely love that scent and then the last one I got is very similar but it's chocolate peppermint cream I think this is new or maybe just new to me because I've never heard of this before and I love it Oh, it smells like those little chocolate mints that they give you at Olive Garden when you're leaving. That's what this smells like, but like somehow it has more of a Christmassy vibe to it. The scents in this is crushed peppermint candies, creamy chocolate, white sugar crystals. It smells so fantastic. I love a good minty Christmas scent because it just feels more clean and bright in your area. So I just love every single absolutely if you're going to buy anything let it be one of these two if you love like a clean crisp scent i'm so excited i cannot wait to burn these but 
I am that person who waits until the day after Thanksgiving to decorate. I know most people on YouTube who are into like the decor and cleaning section of YouTube, they're decorating for Christmas like now, like they start on November 1st, but that's just not me. If you want to see my Christmas decor, you do have to wait until the end of November, but I just think that makes this season more special. So anyways, that's it for the Bath & Body Works haul, and if you want to see me declutter my closet, stay tuned, and if not, thank you so much for being here, and I'll see you in the next video. Now I'm going to go ahead and get decluttering. Here is what we're starting with for our towel closet. So first shelf, not bad, just toilet paper and paper towels. This shelf right here, I have no idea what we were trying to do here. It's a disaster. There's light bulbs, batteries present bags, dog stuff, Ziploc bags, just everything going on here. This level, I have literally no idea. It's more dog clothes, dog toys, candles, paint, so much going on. Here we have towels, which looks fine. This started as towels and turned into towels plus other stuff. And then down here, I have like a bunch of plastic bags that we try to reuse, um, extra bedding, and then some hair and bathroom products. So it's just a whole cluttered mess and I'm ready to tackle it.
Okay, you guys, here's the finished product. I will admit it's still not perfect, but I feel a lot better about it because I feel like I got rid of a few things that we just really didn't need that were just wasting space. So this top shelf is still just toilet paper and paper towels. This one right here is just dog stuff. So I have Spike's sweaters, his bandanas here, dog poop bags, water bottle, shampoo, some grooming things, and some toys. His other toys are in the closet right there in boxes. And then this shelf is just miscellaneous town. There's candles here, some fake candles, birthday bags, some top coat paint, which I'm only hanging on to because I don't know if we'll need it in the new house. This is a charger to something. I don't know what, but I'm scared to throw it away. Some, I don't even know, just some random things, batteries, extra light bulbs, and then Ziplocs and brown paper bags. This I did not touch. This is just towels. I didn't touch this one either with towels. And then this right here, all of this is for um, our humidifier and for my breathing treatment because of my asthma. So I didn't want to mess with that. I felt like that's the best place for it to be. Plus, I just have some wallflowers here. And then here on the bottom, I didn't do much to this. I kind of emptied out this basket a little bit. But I still have that basket with like extra skincare and it's mostly like sun products like sunscreen and stuff. Then I have my hair tools right here and then this is all of my plastic bags thrown into one. And then there's a bottle of bleach back there as well. So it's still not perfect but I definitely feel much better about it. If you've made it this far to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you watched the beginning with the Bath and Body Works haul, comment down below and let me know what your favorite Christmas scent is this year because I'm just curious. I love to know what you guys are interested in. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!